Tell a friend to tell a friend. Let's do it all hollers in. And we're back with another NBA 2K24 next gen build video. And today I have a special catfish glass cleaner build for you guys, man. People will see this build and they're gonna think you're all about getting rebounds. Yeah, that's true. You will be able to get rebounds on this build, but you still can block shots. You have good interior defense. You have good passing on this build. The three-point shooting is there. You have big man contact dunks and you have some strength to go along with it. So make sure you watch the video to the end so I can show you guys how I created this masterpiece. Choose the hand of your choice and the jersey number of your choice. Let's get it, man. But before I go any further, you already know what time it is. If you don't know, now you know. There's a like button time and I need you guys to go down and hit that like button. Get this video to 100 likes. And if you haven't already, hit the link in the description to join the Discord. I would really appreciate that. So with this build, we are going with the center position. Seven foot tall is the one of the best heights this year so when you go for a center 7-1 is pretty good man you know if you can get used to the speed then i think you'll be fine you know but you get a lot of versatility with these seven foot bills that's why i created a lot of them on the channel uh we have 242 on the weight 78 wingspan let's get into the build we're going to go ahead and start with the finishing so let's go to the standard dunk man i wanted you guys to have big man contact dunks on this build so we took the standard dunk to an 83 that will give you the pro big man contact dunks as long as you have the vertical up and of course you know we do have good vertical on this build and we're going to go ahead and take that up and let's go ahead and take the strength up too so when we come back up here we don't have to worry about going back down there to take it up for um posterizer and uh fearless finisher so we have that 83 on the standing dunk right we get silver fast twitch silver rise up we get area wizard on this build which is a really really good badge okay for the driver dunk we're going to get that up to an 80 Taking it up high, you will change the name of the build, so that's why we left it at an 80. And taking the standard dunk up too high, we change the name as well, so that's why I left it at an 83. On the layup, we're going to take that to a 70, but we take the close shot to a 77. So that will allow us to get uh, Fearless Finisher on Silver, as you can see. Um, post fade phenom dream shake hook specialist if y'all want those badges there are ways to adjust this and go back and get that but i didn't add any post control on this build um, i do a lot of post controls on builds and i know people get tired of seeing post controls on every build that i create so you know sometimes i don't put post controls on the build but if you are a person that like post control by all means add it to your build that's totally up to you because this is only a blueprint so don't take this stuff personal man a lot of people take this stuff personal and they just feel like oh he telling me to create this this bill no i'm not telling you to create this bill i'm giving you a blueprint giving you options to go create the bill and change what you want to change and then you go out there and play the way you play i'm not telling you to create this bill you feel what i'm saying so don't take this stuff personal which a lot of people do and i, I really don't like that man but you know that's just how it is these days but let's go ahead and get into the sauce my bad the green bean make your girl scream badge and this build does have a 77 three-point shot a 78 three-point shot does change the name of the build so hey man we left it at a 77 and i think that's pretty good for people out there that know their shots and they're used to shooting with low three-point shots so i took the mid-range shot up to a 72 you can't take that up too high because it would change the name of the build i think you can get it to around a 76 or something i want to say before you uh change the name but we took it to a 72 and the reason, 70, reason I did 72 is because Middle Magician is on silver at 72, as you can see. Okay, for the free throw, we do a 62 on that. So that's um, pretty good, in my opinion. If you want to change that, go ahead and change that. That's totally up to you. But we do get catch and shoot on this bill. Claymore, corner specialist. You got dead out on bronze. We got green machine. We got blinders, uh, guard up, open looks, and whistle, man. So we do have some pretty good badges on this bill. So you guys won't be out there. Uh, lacking when it comes to shooting but let's go ahead and get into the sauce but before we do i need you guys to do me a huge favor right go down there hit that like button hit that subscribe button hit that share button and let the video play to the end because that will push the video to the recommended page so everybody mama can see this video and i need everybody mama see the video so do that for your boy boy now with this bill we can take the pass to a 75 and be good with that that's fine okay but we took it to a 77 we get a relay passer. Is it relay passer? Yeah, we get relay passer on silver. We get needle threader on bronze. So this is a really, really good passer build. So when you get the rebound with this build, you don't necessarily have to kick the ball up the court because you do get a 62 
ball handler. Now, don't be out there trying to dribble around no lockdowns. Now, you're going to get plucked like a chicken. So, you know, be careful with that. Um, in the speed with ball, we took that up to a 48 so we can get the uh, big driver badge. So, we do have good passing, like I said, because we got touch passer, special delivery, relay pass. We got all these badges, man. And, you know, you can go out there and make some good passes with a 77 passing this year. Ball handler is a 62. Like I said, we do get big driver once we take the acceleration up. So, let's go ahead and take the speed and acceleration up right quick to show you guys that you do get big driver on at least silver okay you can't get these other badges it's not gonna happen unpluckable you need a 75 post control or 70 ball handle we can't get uh, the ball handle and i didn't take the post control up that high so we don't get that badge if you want that badge go ahead and change it but that was a way that i did it to have some post control i just didn't um you know show it you know what i'm saying but uh there are ways to change this depending on what you like so for the interior defense, we're going to take that up to 82. That does give us post lockdown on silver. That's pretty good. You know, if you want to change the name of the bill, take it up to 84. That will change the name of the bill. Now, on the perimeter defense, we didn't touch that. You can change that if you want to. Um, the only thing you really get is workhorse and off-ball pairs. So if you want off-ball pairs, go ahead and take it up to a 58. On the steel, we didn't add anything. On the steel, you can add a 60 steel if you want to get intercepted. That's up to you. On the block, we're going to take that to a 92 because that does give us anchor on goal. We also get chase down artists on gold and we will get pogo uh, high in the silver. But um, the chase down artists this year is really, really good. Now, interior defense, I don't think that's good. I, I still don't think that's good. You, you feel what I'm saying? It just depends on what badge you have. Now, if you have badges like um, high, like immo immovable enforcer and stuff like that, now you may be okay. You know what I'm saying? But if you don't have a high, it's going to be some problem for you. You know what I'm saying? So, Having a 92 interior defense, I think, it, I mean, a 92 uh, block is pretty good for that goal anchor. Okay, on the rebound, we're going to take the defense, the offensive rebound into a 93. Okay, that does give us Hall of Fame box because we do have that strength. So that will hold the box out, and that's what you want to do. And then you want to be able to jump up and get the rebound. And the defense rebound is an 85, man, because I've been noticing, man, when you got like a big gap from offense to defense, man, you're going to jump. You're not going to jump the same on the other one. Okay, this one is not that bad. You know, it's like all by eight. But, man, when it's when I, at least a big gap, like 93, like a lot of people like to do it like this. They'll do something like this right here. They'll do like a 90, whatever it go to. They'll do this. A, 92, a 93 and a 58 or a 60 or something like that. Like, that's terrible if you ask me. You know what I'm saying? But if you, if you want to do that, go ahead. But I wouldn't suggest doing that. You know, because it's going to be rough on you. So we have an offensive rebound of a 93 and a defensive rebound of an 85, and that's pretty good. We got a 68 speed, 58 acceleration, 90 on the strength. That's what I'm talking about. That goal and move by enforcer, really, really good badge. And we also have uh, an 80 vertical, and the rest is on stamina. Now let's get it to these shades up. Are you ready? Because guess what? I do not clickbait. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Now we do have shades of... Walker Kessler, Wendell Carter Jr., and Sengun. And the bill is the glass cleaner. That's the bill. I'm out of here, man. Charge!